this is just a quick intro for what you guys are about to see. This is just what I eat and kind of like the average school day. It doesn't look like this every day. It kind of just depends on what is in the pantry and what is not. It's not healthy by any means. Yeah, let's get straight into the video. Hope you guys like it and let's go. So I try and be gluten free when and where possible. So for breakfast, I always have toast. Recently, I have been having this kind of weird combo where people kind of judge me for this, but hey, like it's whatever. But basically it's just Marmite with tomato on top. Like don't attack me if you haven't tried it because let me tell you, it is absolutely beautiful. And as you can see, I was pretty proud of it and it tasted so good. Like my mouth is watering editing this. And I always have a glass of icy water. So since this was a school day, I did have to pack my school lunch for the day. So I start off with this keto bread. Normally wouldn't have keto bread, but mum picked up the wrong one at the supermarket and it actually didn't taste that bad. So on my sandwiches, I put carrot, ham, and lettuce. But again, this bread is gluten-free, and the brand Home Street makes the best sandwich bread that I've found to date that is gluten-free, that actually tastes like normal bread, so I would definitely recommend that. And I always wrap my sandwiches up in my beeswax wraps. I mean, you probably can't realistically fit two sandwiches in one wrap, but I kind of just make it fit because the bread is tiny. So I just pack all of my food into the same lunchbox. So there we have a whole food bar, which is one of the tasty bars. Some chocolate cutter Oreos, which have changed my life. They're absolutely beautiful. And then we have some of these veggie chip straw things. They're also really nice. And they're also gluten free, which is a bonus. And then some dark chocolate with some almonds. Just some plain original salted Dorito chips. Top it off some of the raw snacking superfood boost nuts, which I didn't actually end up eating on this particular day. And then I kind of just jam it all in my lunchbox and just make it fit. And then I always take my swell water bottle to school, which keeps my water cold for the whole day, which is pretty sick. I got home from school at about four o'clock and we had some leftover pizza from the night before. So I just chucked that in the oven and had that for afternoon tea along with my bottle of water, which I kind of just eat throughout the afternoon eat you don't eat water that I drink throughout the afternoon and that was pretty nice I wouldn't normally do that but I was all about it and since it was a bit cold since winter is unfortunately coming I did make myself a hot chocolate with my afternoon tea which is kind of a weird combo like I wouldn't probably put hot chocolate with pizza but hey like it's fine it tasted great so I put in the jar of hot chocolate mix along with some hot water, some cold water to cool it down a little bit so I could drink it a bit faster because I'm impatient, and then some almond milk. And now if you haven't done this before, I would recommend, it's called a Tim Tam Slam. If you have Tim Tams, if you're from like Australia or New Zealand, where you buy one of each of the corners off and then use it as a straw and suck your hot chocolate through it and the chocolate melts and the biscuit melts and you eat it and oh my gosh, it is the best thing. So if you haven't done that and you have Tim Tams where you're from, definitely give it a go. And then we move on to dinner, which in my family normally have at around 7 30 so this is kind of like a Stevens family classic where we have teriyaki chicken on rice normally we would have it with um potato and salad but this particular night we had it with steamed veggies so then I just top it with teriyaki sauce um Japanese mayonnaise and sesame seeds and it is so good and then I have a big glass of water I ended up having two bits of mora chocolate for dessert which was absolutely amazing that brings me to the end of this video thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week Hey, feeling good, like I should. When in the neighborhood, <laughs> feeling blessed, never stressed. Got that sunshine.